all derive from, from dehydroepiendosterone. The single most important part about the pheromone that I have found is that if you mess up the sequence or the, or the ratio, if the one is higher and lower than it shouldn't be, it, it really it tends to impede the effect. Like you can saturate. An example is if you are smelling something, you know, after a while, you lose the actual sensation that you're smelling it. Well, the same thing happens here. So we're really talking about an extraordinarily complicated process. That we, we have the dehydroepiendosterone and three others. So we don't usually reveal what those three others are. Uh, but they're natural. They, they occur in the axilla. Um, but the ratio of that is very important in getting an, getting an effect.